my crafty friends. I hope you had a wonderful holiday. And I am back with crafted goals to show what I did in December and to show you some of the goals that I have written down for January. So let us begin. For December, I did do the uh, show us your sheet load on the 2nd. And I had already edited and uh, uploaded my process videos. And so they went all on, on schedule. And then my computer got stuff spilled on it. And it worked. But the part where you plug it in didn't want to work for some reason. So I did as much as I could on mobile. But it wasn't cooperating, and so I could not get my Crafty Goals video up. Although this was already uploaded, ready to go, I could not do my Crafty Goals. And I apologize for that. I made probably about 130 Christmas cards altogether. And so my goal every year is to try to get them out no later than the end of the second week. Sometimes I do okay, sometimes I don't. I did manage to get the uh, 10 on the 10th video up. And I couldn't do the embellishments or could I do my uh, planned back to basics video on dies and die cutting. But I did get that done and uploaded for the 30th. So, um... Yeah, this week, uh, hubby got sick on the 8th. I got sick on the 10th. On the 13th, he was tested COVID positive. And then on the 16th, I was. So no videos were going out. We were both sick. Uh, he got over it a lot faster than I did. I'm still up and down. So there wasn't anything done until... I got my Stampin' Up! order, so I went ahead and did an unboxing video of that. But I have since taken it down. So, yeah, I just I just made that decision. And that's, that's fine. Anyway, so here's Christmas. It was a wonderful Christmas. And then on the 26th, I did smash that small paper pad. Oh, in between here, I did get a new computer. And, it, and the, like I said, there is a learning curve, but it's it's going well. So I got smashed up small paper pad, and I made the coffee cards. And I had one in particular that said OCD, obsessive coffee drinker. I sent that one to my daughter. <laughs> So, like I said, I did do the uh, the basics, how to start your own cards, dies and die cuttings. And I am so thankful for, I, I'm just over 450 subs for the year. And I'm so very, very happy, happy for that, for a total of, I think it's 794 now. So, I'm just, yes, the end of the years have always been good for me. And I am so happy that I did make my Christmas cards in advance because even addressing them, uh, I ended up taking them to work with me and just addressing when I had free time. <laughs> so, it all worked out. And then, of course, when I got sick, and especially when I knew I was positive, I didn't send out any more cards. So there's December. And as you can see, it's all decorated. So for the next year, for January, I'm going to go ahead and use my Christian planner for 2021. This one is a spiral bound. This is the one I had for this year, 2020, and I actually used it for planning this year. 
I, I haven't in the past. So wouldn't you know it? So I am so thinking that we're all looking forward to a better year this year. So anyway, this is spiral bound. And I did put, I have some post-it tabs that I put on the first page of the next month. I think that's going to work out well. So let's get started. So here's the end of December and on to today. So shooting videos and then I uploaded this, the die cutting. And then these are, I have different work stickers that I put when I work. Let's go to the month itself. So that will be, these are pages for sermon notes and Bible study. So let's see, where is that? I had them. Oh, there it is. Okay, I knew I had the month at a glance. So that's what I'm going to be doing, showing you guys for this. So my goals are two videos a week. And right now, these are my collaborations or videos that I have, that I plan every month. Crafty goals, the 10 minute uh, with. The Show Us Your Sheet Load sketch from Alicia. 10 on the 10th, The Embellishments. Club Echo Park, I am subscribed to that, so it's an every other month kit. And then my How To Back to Basics. And I will play along with other collaborations as they come up. And I, put, I wrote down somewhere my other goals. I do want to use up my stash. I'm sure we all do. And like I said, um, I can play along with Beth's Smash Your Stash, which that's going to be a lot of fun because we all have lots of stash, I'm sure. So anyway, that is my basic idea for January. And we will just see how everything goes. The world is trying to get back into some semblance of normality. So thank you so much for joining me. And please make sure to watch all the other collaborators to see what they have planned for 2021. See you soon. Bye-bye.